All right, guys, welcome to a brand new series on the channel, Metro Last Like Redux. My name is Raven from the Sky. Thank you for joining me. Now, I never played these. I've only seen footage here and there over the years. Um, I am more of a Fallout fan, but since I am a Fallout fan and a fan of post-apocalyptic uh, open-ended games, I decided to give this a try. And um, yeah, since Fallout 76 is feels like it's right around the corner, why not? So this intro's a bit long. When the garden's direction. The Dark Ones, huge, towering a full head over the highest man. Nightmarish creatures, creepy as a man turned inside out. Monsters born to destroy us. The word was they were incredibly strong and unnaturally evil. That with bare paws they could tear armed men apart. Joseph. That's all lies. Truth is even scarier. All right. Well, I used to live nearby. Before the war, I mean, uh, up there. I was on the train when it happened. I tried calling my family, but couldn't get through. What the hell? What happened? Okay, now what was that? Shit. Heart thumping, dude. All right, we Shit. can move. Shit. What's going on here? Oh! Oh! No! Oh, we were hallucinating. Oh, my. It's me, Khan. Nightmare. Oh, it's a nightmare. No wonder. After all you've been through. Listen, I have incredible news. A couple of days ago, I was near the ruins of the Dark One's hive, and I saw one of them, still alive. I immediately set out to find you, as you were the one they tried to contact, before you launched the missile strike against them. Khan! How the hell did you get here? Get out! Now! Yes, Ullman, one moment. If a Dark One has survived, it is vital that you try to speak with it, Artyom. I realize that, as one of the Order now, you report to Miller. But we must persuade him to allow this mission. Khan, I told you to get out! This is a classified base. You shouldn't even be here. I'll take you to Colonel Miller. Follow me, Artyom. Get ready, Artyom. I'll be waiting at the exit. Move it, you windbag. I knew a smoker once. During the last year of his life, he had to eat, drink, and breathe for a tiny hole in his throat. Okay. What else can we do? Dark one. Follow Khan to meet with. Okay. War was inevitable, they said. The people believed in a better future. Привет, Артём. Артём was one of the men who found D6. They gave him a ranger's badge on the spot. It's nice for him. I had to spend two years as a cadet before they accepted me into the order. This is what Fallout 76 is gonna be like. 
And that's online. I, I can't wait to see what that's going to be. Fallout online. We're going to hang out and eat canned beans. <laughs> and squish rad roaches. He's leaking repeater on him. Y'all remember that? Fallout 3? Look at those two rookies. Pathetic. Doing good. No Carry on. The corner or the training time down. Sharper. Move sharper. You're shitting me. The rest of the group? Wiped out? The marshes are easy. You just look for the markers and flags and walk along them so you don't drown. The child. Hello, Arthur. Oh, here we go. Welcome to the armory. I hear you're a ranger now, huh? We must get a drink sometime to celebrate. For now, let's get you equipped. So, first things first. You're going to need a gas mask. Oh, of course. You can't a step on the surface without a gas mask. It's been 20 years and the radiation's still strong enough in some places to boil water. There are hot spots down here in the metro, too. Don't forget filters for the mask. Sure, it looks cool enough even without these, but they definitely make it better for your health. Now medkins. Well, what can I say? Anything you need for survival in a stylish orange case. That is pretty stylish, though. Here's your advanced salary for this month. Remember, your pay is in military-grade rounds. Sure, you can use them as usual ammo for some hefty extra damage, but saving them to buy guns, attachments, regular ammo and equipment from merchants anywhere in the metro seems like a smarter move. Get you some guns. Oh yeah. Get the ones you want and try them out on my range. All right, valve. Kalash. That's what we use in the beginning. That's a shotgun, a revolving shotgun. So probably. SMG. Shotguns are always good for stopping power at close range. <laughs> Just don't go trying to snipe the bot. I always carry a pistol. Steady, yep. reliable, and accurate. Veteran. Actually, like so ugly. Okay, let's see. Definitely going to put that in the muzzle. But tightening the buckshot spread pattern. Bye. Okay, uh. Of course, I want more accuracy. Alright, Head over to my range and try out 
those guns. Come back if you want to try a different gun. Hey, Artyom, put on the show for me, huh? Try out the rest of the weapons you chose. Nothing. Try shooting for the center of the regular damage. Good shot! Now shoot the armor damage. Notice the difference? It's going to take more bullets to penetrate the bullet. Look for sparks. Shooting an armor target. Try a headshot. That's a critical hit. Notice the difference? Those are the basics. You can keep practicing if you want, or head on up to Miller's briefing. That though. All right, let's head on out. I don't want the whole episode to be a tutorial, which it probably is going to be anyway. We're going to get irradiated here for damn sure. No way. The base is clear. At least the part we're in. They've checked it. Miller's calling the group leaders in. There's going to be a big assembly. Please, oh, goodness, Lord, please. I was on duty in the Situation Room yesterday, so I heard something. Seems like there's all right kinds of things going up. So, you're an expert on hell and its denizens. At last, someone with a common interest. Pay no attention to this clown, Alex. Open the gates! Have you heard about Lesnitsky? What are you talking about? Check with the guards at the lab. Shit. What the hell did he do? Opening up! All right, let's go. The tombs of ancient kings were filled with whatever they might need in the afterlife. Weapons, gold, chariots. They'd sacrifice their wives and slaves to serve their lords even in death. It reminds me of this bunker. Cut that shit out! The things in D6 are like what the Conqueror took with him beyond the grave. Gold steel, and wild steeds, and treasures untold. Of course, the Tomb Raiders would always die horribly, killed by demons or ghosts, or their own greed. Khan, will you shut up or what? Tomb Raiders, huh? Hey, I heard that Lesnitsky did something. What happened? Nobody knows. Lesnitsky was at the lab. When the next shift came, the door was open and the lab ransacked. Lesnitsky was gone. Shit! So, what's inside? Chemical weapons, maybe some other shit. That's, that's all I heard. God damn it. The colonel's going to tear me a new one because of Lesnitsky. A red hot poker right into my soul. If I still have all right, let's go. We might control D6, but it's like a damn city down here. All the bunkers, the nooks and crannies and exits. Still, the base the order dreamed of finding. Guys just came back from the ring. They say cancer is strengthening the sentry points along the whole line. Especially Miller the ones ordered all our houses. men assembled here on this base. Let's hear what he has to say at the assembly. I have a bad feeling. Kerman, take these guys to Miller. They've been summoned. Yes, sir. All right, go on in. I'll wait here. When you've gone, I'll speak to Miller. <laughs> All right, let's go. The bombing of the Dark Ones may have been humanity's worst mistake. What if they meant us no harm, but were trying to communicate? Perhaps the severe pain and loss of consciousness suffered in their presence just meant we were incompatible. Machines with different wiring. But somehow you, Artyom, have the common wire. The connection with the Dark Ones. Yes, people died at exhibition. Your home station. Hunter, the best of the order, is most likely dead as well. And he taught you this. If we don't fight for our lives in this new world, we'll be devoured. 
It is the law of evolution. But I would argue the old laws no longer apply. Ah. Oh, and Metro Exodus is the sequel to this, which releases uh, next year. Right. 2019. Gordon. And you, God. Don't know when, though. Something to report? Yes, Gordon. Let's keep it short, then. I located the surviving Dark One at the gardens. What? One of those things is still alive? Luckily, yes. Luckily? Come, this is utter madness. The Dark Ones were the greatest threat the Orders ever faced. Connell, just give me a chance. A single Dark One is no threat. Artyom has a gift. I believe he can establish contact with the creature. Let him come with me. All right. Artyom, go with Khan to the gardens and locate the Dark One. I'll send a sniper along. My best. Anna. Yes, sir. Why would we need a sniper? To eliminate the creature and finish the Orca's job. Miller, you can't! It's murder! Restrain him! You idiot! You're making the same mistake that... We're done here. Escort Khan out of here. Artyom! It's your last chance for forgiveness! For getting rid of the nightmares! Ah. Forget about Khan. Looks like he got close, too close to the creature and lost his mind. Look here, Artyom. Complete the mission and get back here quickly. A war is coming and I'll need every ranger at his post. On your way. So, what are you waiting for? Come along, rabbit. Artyom, if it's true that the Dark Ones can sense you, maybe you could draw it out from hiding so Anna can have a clear shot. But maybe. do me a favor. Don't let the Dark One get into your mind, or Anna will have two targets. Is that understood? We now suspect Lesnitsky was a sleeper agent, but we haven't verified who's running him. Your job is to intercept him before he delivers the stolen container. Understood? Yes, sir. If Lesnitsky escapes with the container, the entire Metro is at risk. So if you can't take him alive, you damn well better bring me his head. Yes, sir. This wrist. I must do what Hunter demanded of me. What Miller ordered me. What Anna expects, expects of me. I must prove to them all that I deserve to be one of them. To be one of the Order's fighters. To dedicate my life to the protection of humanity. Protection of the Metro. This mission is tailor-made for me. I am the only one impervious to the influence of the Dark Ones. Perhaps I was born to rid humanity of them once and for all, and now I am one step from fulfilling that task. So why am I so uneasy? Because deep down you know this is wrong. That nightmare wasn't for nothing. It's a connection. Don't tell me you believe that bullshit about making peace with the Dark Ones. I wish I had been up in that tower myself to see the missiles fall and watch them burn in their nests. Come on, Rabbit. Would you let those things into the Metro? Let them crawl into our brains so they could use us like animals. Maybe we could mate with them so the children could live on the surface and feed off the radiation. Shit. You don't shake hands with the devil. Please step away from the edge of the platform. Train coming in. Alright. Pop in like a good little rabbit. Well, we've worn this place out. Let's move. Call me Rabbit here. Just a year ago, I stood on top of the TV tower and saw missiles rain on the botanical gardens, turning the flesh into ashes, smelting metal and glass. Nobody and nothing could survive that inferno. Yet Khan did find a dark one there. Now my mission is to find and eliminate it. To finish what I started.
In the past, trains were ordinary things. But now, this monorail seems magic, doesn't it? Our kids won't know how to operate these things. And their kids will probably think this was built by the gods. Yeah. Actually, when I play that Metro Exodus, I saw the E3 footage. So, what better way to kind of get into the Metro games and playing, you know, Last Light or 2033? I'll try to put some juice on the system and get the lights on. Use their flashlights in the meantime. 20, I remember 2033, I think, came out in right. between Ready? 20, 2008, between 2008 and 2012. Didn't you and my father take the monorail when you went out to fire the missiles at the Dark One's nest? That's a good sign, Rabbit. Maybe we'll have luck with this mission, too. I oh, no flashlight. Power's working. Open the gate. I'll cover the passage. Great. You did fine after all. All clear. Move out. All right. The map shows a collector entry point ahead. Move. I'm following. Go right. There's a dead end on the left. Something alarmed them. Stay sharp. I'm pretty sure we'll have to do Whoa! Shit, that thing's fast. I was gonna say I'm pretty sure we have to deal with the survivors too. Or the factions. Great. That aren't a part of our little it's order little or whatever. Then we'll see if you're a rabbit or man. Surface, put your mask on. With looking at my ass, it's way out of your reach, rabbit. <laughs> Kinda don't have a choice. Give me a hand here. to the main entrance. There's a good shooting position there. I can cover a lot of territory. You're supposed to be immune to their... what? Influence? Well, I don't have any gift. So hop along, rabbit. Head on in and look for the creature. I'm thinking that since the Dark Ones are so fond of you, it'll sense you, or smell you, or whatever the fuck they do, and come from hiding. Just try to stay in the open so I can cover you. We'll maintain radio contact. I wonder, are we? Second thoughts. Don't worry. I'll do it. Okay, then. Good luck. I wonder, are we like a dark one? And see, that thing was in the Exodus. Uh, what's the name? I'm in position. Video. Something's still burning where the nest was. That's some fine wasteland. You guys sure did a good job here. Strange. What could still be burning after all this time? Well, it doesn't matter. Move towards it. I'll cover you. I see some kind of movement. Get ready. On the right. Oh! Working on them. Those are the dark ones. They're watching. Down, boy. Now, what is that?
Right. Okay, it's down. Oh. Oh. They look like aliens. The creature I met in the burnt-out remains of the gardens looks like a dark one. And it was able to enter my mind, dragging the innermost out of me. But it was also just the baby. And I am sure that it recognized me. And got scared. It also left me knocked out for some time. Just enough for me to get captured. <laughs> These prisoners were captured at the botanical gardens. Seems like they were looking for something. These two are red. They refuse to speak. The third one looks like a ranger of the order. A mutant the size of a child was caught near him. It was delivered to Reich as well. I'll deal with it later. Mm -hmm. the other factions. No, no, I'm normal. See, two arms, two legs, ten fingers. Don't you understand? I'm a Hansa citizen. Shut up! <laughs> Not in Hatsa. Here you are a suspect in the distribution of corrupted genes. Hey. And this is your trial. If your skull has the correct proportions, you are free to go. If not, you are an abomination. Science, you see. This is an outrage! I told you to stay still! Well, let's see. 318 millimeters by 302. Let's look it up in the table. Ah, congratulations. You're a mutant. No, no, please. Do the garbage shoot. A safer question. What was your mission in the garbage? Go to hell yourself. Nazi. I'm gonna count to three. Born. Glory to the red line! Two. Long live Oh my! Three. This, this guy's nuts! I'll, I'll talk! I'll talk! But, but, but away from the other side, they'll kill me if they hear. Okay? Take this one to the second unit. Usually, Reich does not interfere with the Order's business. But here, we have you, the Reds, and the Freak, all caught in the same net. I do not like it. So talk, or take a bullet to the brain. Get the officer! Hey, you! Here. You keep the knife. Keep it. So, uh, you are with the Spartan Order? I'm from the Red Line. Uh, our superiors are not the best of terms, huh? But I say fuck that. No, fuck that. The grunts stick together, huh? <laughs> the fuck? I see. Oh, dear, it is me. Remotely controlled lock. One thing's for sure. Our only chance of getting out of this alive, work together. Right. Now, what did they say about the garbage? Shoot?
You had a pistol, we can't. Okay. Let's get our asses out of this place. Then we'll go our separate ways. Huh? All right, let's go then. Oh my god. There's a riot and an escape that just opened the valve and turned the prison into one big gas chamber. Suki. Sure learned from their predecessors. We'll go as soon as the elevator leaves. Let's move. Sweet mother of God, I heard rumors of a concentration camp here, but to see it with my own eyes. There's a tunnel on the other side. Okay, I lead, you follow. Now keep it quiet, or they'll guess everyone. Let's move. Stay out of the light and stick to the shadows. They are your best friend. Okay, tak, 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 tak. Looks like we cleared it. Let's see, let's see. A great. Yeah, brilliant. That flock didn't even budge, huh? All right, we can't go through here. That we know. Okay, right. where do we go now? What if? Hey, hey, give me a lift, will you? Where are you going? If I'm going across. Take him out. We'll find some way to shut the power off or something. Oh. Shh. Duck, duck. Now listen. Pretend you're a little fucking mouse. Get down. Don't make any sudden moves. See? Well, let's move. To think of huh? You can do nothing but harm, and we will Freeze. save innocent lives just by shooting you. No, we're not going to shoot you. Thank you, officer. Thank you. Cure says shooting. Move! Good they deserve nothing more. Go then! And it's a good show. <laughs> Follow me. I don't quite agree with you. Cura is infallible. Of course. The hanged man in his bowels, and we have to do that. Okay, you it's take done. the right one, I the left one. I will distract you mine, do. then you take yours down. Please. Understand? Please. Get to it. I'm Don't start too soon, huh? <laughs> Let's do it! <laughs> you won't stand up too much. <laughs> you do that with a it's efficient and elegant. <laughs> Listen, you hear that? Sounds like something fell. Piece of plaster, perhaps. Student cube. And? Did you make this? No, it wasn't me. I, I swear to God. I don't know if we're going to take anyone away today. Just you, well, look at that. Prick. You're lucky. I was afraid you'd scream. Hey, do you hear me? Look, there is a lever. It releases the ladder. Get as many of them as you can. We're done anyway. You ain't gonna do <laughs> this. Will you? The controls are up there in the guard room. Please. No. And screw the light bulb. See, I can't get across there without being seen. Now I can. Food. Some food. Any food. As if we'd waste any on you. You're dead meat anyway. <laughs> hey, man. Open the locks. There's a panel in the guard room. There you go. I see you're not here for a walk. Hey, open the cells. The controls are in the guardroom. Hey! 
Well, well, what's making you stop? You had a good start. Just go on as you did. What do you mean you released it? Are you out of your mind? I don't know. Just looked at him and somehow saw myself. Control, they're in the guard room. I feel like we're gonna fall through this. Shoot it, that it paid good money, so I just show me the bullets. Sure, sure, look. I'm ready to share. It's too much for me alone. Just don't tell the Oberschaffur. I got 200 bullets. Out. I'll take half. It's just that our shift is in. Then you have no further business here. Off to the barracks with you. Yes. Oh my. You need to do for target practice. The dead botanical gardens were always a deadly deserted place. Stalkers used to avoid it even before the dark ones built their hive or city there. I was the only person in the world who'd eagerly go there. But this time some Reich stalkers were there too. These race purists almost never venture out of their stations in the center of the city. What were they looking for in the smoldering remains of the gardens? And why didn't Anna help me? Miller's daughter would never abandon a comrade. Comrade. What if they captured her too? She's a rude tomboy and seems to hate me to boot. Since I'm nothing like Hunter, but I'm worried about her. Will you? The controls are up there in the guard room. Please. This gate will belong to them soon enough. I what are you still doing here? Oh, if all the notes. Don't worry. This gate will belong to them soon enough. No matter what I do, it's still hard for the big. Oh, shoot. There's a control up there. You can open all the cells. I can't stay here anymore. Look, look, close it. I want to leave. I want to leave. You're out of the inner block. Well, the farm is just starting, William. Here, catch this. I don't see no control room. Nice watch. I thought it was an achievement to free him, too. Lights up when you're visible, huh? You take the low route, I'll take the top and cover you.
No, there's nothing on the shelf. Open your eyes. It's here. In the box. I'm up here though. This is what they were talking about. I see. There we go. Uh, what I say? It was an achievement to free him. Alright guys, I'm going to stop it here. Thank you for joining me for this episode of Metro The Last Light Redux. My name is Raven from the Sky. If you like this episode, drop a like and subscribe to help the channel and the series grow. Thank you for your support. Take care and I'll catch you guys in the next